The figure below, not drawn to scale, is made up of two squares, A, B, C, D, and D, E, F, G. A, G, H is a triangle. Find the area of the unshaded part that's here. So how do you think we can solve the question? First of all, let me help by cutting away the triangle so that you can see the two squares. So step number one, I'm going to find the area of the two squares. So the formula to find the area of two square is length times breadth or length times length. In this case, the big square would be 5 times 5, which is equals to 25. And the small square is 4 times 4, which is equals to 16. So let me sum them up because they are joined together. So 25 plus 16 is equals to 41. So the sum of these two squares here that we have now is equals to 41 square centimeters. Now back to the question, they want us to find the area of the unshaded part, which is right here. And since I have found the area of the two squares, I can just simply take the area of the two squares and subtract the triangle and I'll get the unshaded part. But wait, how do we find the area of the triangle? Do we know the base and the height of the triangle? We can take base as 2 centimeters. But what about the height of the triangle? Well, the height of the triangle is the sum of BC and EF, which is equal to 9 centimeters. So the formula to find area of triangle is half times base times height. So in this case, the base is 2 centimeters, half times 2 times 9 and I'll get 9 square centimeters. So to find the area of the unshaded part, we will take the area of the two squares which is 41, subtract the triangle which is 9 and we will get 32. And 32 is the answer. 32 square centimeters.